Hello, I'm Ann John, the 125th president of the Pennsylvania Bar Association. I'm reaching out to reinforce the message to all members that our PBA officers and staff, many fellow members and your Bar Association as a whole are working tirelessly in your interests during the COVID-19 pandemic. We are reaching out to the executive, judicial, and legislative branches about the concerns of our lawyer members. And we, of course, continue to monitor the steps they are taking as we attempt to chart paths through this new territory we find ourselves in. We have been at work on your behalf from the beginning of this crisis in many ways. We've communicated with the courts. We've reached out to the governor. We filed for a waiver on behalf of the membership and we've reached out to the CLE board. The work continues and will continue throughout the pandemic. Our staff is working remotely, as are the vast majority of you. We are all in this together. Many of your members will have questions about the future activities and actions of the PBA. Some of those questions can and will be answered in the short term. Others, by virtue of the nature of this pandemic, cannot and should not be answered until such time as the health and well being of our families and our communities are no longer in jeopardy from COVID 19. To further support you, our members, during this unique situation, I've created a COVID 19 task force. That task force was created to develop member programs and initiatives and to serve as a resource for you during this crisis. It has created a resource guide that is available on the PBA homepage, www.pabar.org. You've likely noticed that we've increased the number of emails that we are sending to you. Some emails are updates specifically about PBA activities, others are about events, and some are about the orders from the governor and our Supreme Court. All of those emails contain links and resources and other information that we hope you are finding to be useful and helpful during this time. In addition to the emails and updates, please check the website periodically and follow us on social media, Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn are all being updated regularly. And you'll find the information and links to continuing legal education webinars, on-demand courses, and other helpful guidance through all of that media. When I began my term as PBA president last May, I had the theme from Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood Played. I mentioned that I would be visiting many PBA neighborhoods. I had no idea at that time that I would approach the end of my term in a fashion that allows me to travel virtually into your neighborhoods. All of us are navigating uncharted waters, but we're rapidly adjusting to these unique circumstances that have brought us to each other's neighborhoods in a virtual manner. While we are disappointed that we won't catch up with each other in person, we're turning that disappointment into an opportunity to embrace and appreciate the technology that allows us to continue most PBA services and many meetings through that technology. I am here to reassure you that the PBA is a strong and steady link to the resources and support that all of us need now more than ever. PBA is here for you. Stay safe, stay well, take care.